In this video, we're going to compare the Logitech MX Master 3S to the Logitech MX Master Anywhere 3S wireless Bluetooth mouse. These are two of the best wireless mice that are both made by Logitech, and they offer quite a few similar features, but there's also a few notable differences that we're going to go over in this video. So both the Anywhere and the Master are very comfortable and ergonomic to use. They're both a little bit taller than your average mouse, which gives better wrist relief compared to using something like the Apple Magic Mouse or a non-ergonomic mouse. I have links for both of these mice and several other Logitech keyboards in the description below, so be sure to check those out too. I find that the Master 3S is a bit more comfortable to use than the Anywhere because the whole mouse is just a little bit bigger. It's taller, longer, and wider, and it also has an additional spot on the side for putting your thumb on the Master which is just really comfortable to use. And the angle that your wrist is at is just a little bit better in my opinion. But the Anywhere 3S is still pretty comfortable to use too. Both of the mice offer a ton of flexibility with programming, giving you several custom buttons, including two side buttons where your thumb goes, as well as you can click the zoom button and there's a button below the zooming. But on the Master 3S, you also get a side scroll wheel, and you get a thumb gesture button, which is really cool because when you press that button and then you move the mouse in a different direction, it activates Mac-like gestures, like using two or three finger swipe on a trackpad or on the Magic Mouse. So this makes the Master 3S a lot more versatile and easier to use if you're a Mac user. I've also really enjoyed the horizontal scroll wheel on the Master 3S. Even though I've never had one before, it's very intuitive to use and it makes editing and applications like Final Cut Pro a breeze. Now, the Anywhere 3S does allow you to use gestures, but you have to reprogram one of your buttons to use it. And then you have to do that in every single app in the Logi Options Plus app. Whether you're using Final Cut or Excel, you have to get in and change all of those to activate the gestures button. So that can be a little bit of a pain and a nuisance. You can also use horizontal scrolling on the Anywhere 3S by pressing and holding one of the side buttons while scrolling with the scroll wheel. So you get several of those features that the Master has. They're just a little bit more cumbersome to use. I compared the sound of the clicking on the Master and the Anywhere, and the clicking on the Anywhere is just a little bit louder than the clicking on the Master. The Anywhere and the Master both use Bluetooth and can be paired to up to three devices at one time, which is really cool because you can flip the mouse over and press the device pairing button to cycle between what devices you're using. So you can seamlessly switch between using your computer or your iPad or a second computer too. It's just really quick and easy to switch what device each of these mice are paired to. The Master and the Anywhere are both compatible with the Logitech Bolt USB receiver, but only the Master includes this. This allows you to just plug in the USB dongle to any computer, even if it doesn't have Bluetooth, and to still be able to use the mouse. So you get that for free with the Master 3S. I love that both of these mice have the USB-C charging port on top of them, which means that you can still use the mouse while it's being charged. Take notes, Apple. Both of them have up to 70 hours of use, and if they're dead, charge them for one minute and you get three hours of use out of them. So battery life on both of these is not an issue at all. The Master is available in graphite, pale gray, and black, while the Anywhere is available in graphite, pale gray, black, and rose. Now that we've compared all the features of the MX Anywhere 3S and the MX Master 3S, let's discuss different scenarios in which you should choose to buy a certain mouse. The MX Master 3S retails for $100 and the MX Anywhere retails for $80. So they're very similar in price. I would buy the Master 3S for programmability and comfort. You get that horizontal side button and you also get the gesture button. So that just unlocks a little bit more custom use out of the mouse when you compare it to the MX Anywhere 3S. But then on the flip side, I would pick the MX Anywhere 3S if you're doing a lot of moving around. If you're going to co-work spaces, if you're working at coffee shops or Starbucks, or if you travel around a lot, you're gonna appreciate that smaller size to fit it in your computer case. I would also choose to buy the Anywhere 3S if you want a little bit more mouse looking mouse. The Master 3S looks a little bit crazy in comparison, especially if you're not used to having a true ergonomic mouse. So if you want something that's a little bit sleeker and more classic looking, the Anywhere 3S is better. I would also go ahead and purchase the Master 3S if you have bigger hands or if you find yourself having a lot of wrist pain and comfort issues. 
The Master 3S just has a much more ergonomic feel when you compare it directly to the Anywhere 3S. So to tie it all up, we've compared both the mice. Buy the Anywhere 3S for portability and simplicity. Buy the Master 3S if you want the best in comfort and customization. I have links to buy both the MX Anywhere 3S and MX Master 3S in the description below. So check those out if you're interested in making a purchase. Also check out my other videos for more in-depth reviews of both the Anywhere 3S and the Master 3S, and I'm also covering a bunch of the different Logitech MX keyboards. If you found value in this content, give it a like, subscribe to my channel, and if you have any questions on the Anywhere 3S or the MX Master 3S, or if you think I forgot something, leave a comment down below and let me know.